In this video, I want to take a look at how to insert a blank page in Microsoft Word. There's a few ways we can do this. Let's say that I want to insert a blank page before my text here. And like I want to make a title page or what have you. So what I can do is I can just go to Insert, and then I can go to Blank Page here. And that's really all I need to do. And then you see that there's a blank page here. And notice it inserted a page break. I have here the non-printing characters on, which shows me formats that are occurring behind the scenes. But I can turn that off, and then I just see nothing here. But I have my blank page on page 1, and then I have my text begin on page 2. Alternatively, if I wanted to insert a blank page at the end of the document, then I can just scroll down to the very end, click to the right of the end of the text there where the period is, and then just go ahead and go to insert and then blank page again and that will give me a blank page at the end. If I go to print preview I can see that here. Notice that page 1 and page 6, my last page, are now blank pages. And then for those who are curious you can do this another way as well. If I get rid of my two blank pages by undoing here, I press Control Z. What I can do alternatively is I can go to layout here and I can go to breaks and this gives me all my different page breaks. I can insert a page break here, and that does the exact same thing. Notice that I have a blank page here. I can go to the end of the document, click to the right of the period, and I can do that again. I can insert another break, page break, and then when I print preview, I have the exact same thing. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching.